Hey, in today's tip of the day, you know what good players do? They turn and pivot very well. What does the average player do? They do not turn and pivot very well. As a result, they don't play very well. So today's tip, I'm gonna give you a really good drill to help you train your body to turn and pivot so you can hit the ball a lot more solidly and a lot more consistently. The average golfer tends to have very poor separation between their upper and lower body and they don't turn and pivot very well and hence their swing is very inconsistent. Typically what happens, we see a lot of on the backswing, a lot of hip slide, no turn, they're trying to shift their weight, they slide back here, they hit from their back foot or we get this upper body drift, they're trying to swing the club back too far so we get this big upper body drift and then you know what happens when you do that, you drift back into the ball and you get that you know, out to in attack angle, not very consistent. All good players, despite how their swings look, turn and pivot very well. Whether the swing is long or short, slow or fast, they all turn and pivot well. They all have good separation between upper and lower body. So with this practice drill, you just take your driver, take your golf stance, put it up across your chest. Now we're just gonna do a few quick warm-ups where you twist back and forth. You notice I'm staying centered and I'm turning in place. And the turn and pivot is what moves the club back and forth. Just like that, just do a few of those. Get that feel for a centered turn. And then from there, okay. and then from there, I'm just gonna get set. I'm gonna bend left, first of all. So I'm gonna get a little bit of a side bend to the left, and then I'm gonna turn right. So just to do that again, side bend left, turn right. And that helps me with the separation between upper and lower body so I can make that center turn going back. And then on the forward swing, I'm gonna turn right and then turn left. Again, turn right. So I'm getting this nice side bend here and turn left. So now I'm getting that forward turn separation. So I get that good unwinding and that good position for striking the ball solidly. Bend left. Turn right, bend right, turn left. Really good exercise for improving your pivot and turn. And then put it all together. You really get the feel for the rotation. Might be awkward at first if you're not used to turning and pivoting properly, but it'll really train you, get you into that mode for separating your upper and lower body for a consistent swing and great solid shots every time.